This is 1450 Legion Drive. Looking, we're looking at the front of the property. It needs a little bit of TLC as far as the backyard, but it's minute. They it looks like they just did the landscaping on this property. And if you look at the surrounding area, these are all the surrounding area and the neighborhood itself. Everybody take price of their own properties and it's very much well maintained as far as the neighboring areas now um, let me see this is the front yard and he has a walkway through the fencing area now we're gonna walk into inside the house we're coming up into the foyer keep in mind that there is no electricity in this house because it's a bank owned properties but eventually they will turn it on once you get it under contract but you're entering to the foyer area those are hardwood for all around straight toward looking at the fireplace which is the living room up to your right would be the formal dining area condition of the carpet is still great i think you can still keep it for at least two or three at least two years the walls looks great in the formal dining room looks like in pretty much good shape um, moving back here up to the front let's enter to the kitchen area so these are the wood floor it looks like they just put in a new um, flooring system new vinyl because it looks like in good shape and good condition the house is at least six years old six to twelve and this is the kitchen cabinets it's kind of stained um, wood stained they um, for mica countertops but it looks like it's a brand new because I don't see any imperfection to it and next to that would be your pantry area and then looking at to your right that would be your formal dining room this is the refrigerator which is missing and that's expected and um, across from the sink area would be the stove above it is a microwave the cabinets it's even in good shape if you look at it the stove is as good a condition it's a kenmore this is the wall area and now we're looking at the um the breakfast area and right out would be let me go ahead and go to the backyard while i'm here from the breakfast area you walk out to the um, backyard so you have a little patio right here and you can see the fence and its walkway so it's a fully fenced backyard as you're looking at it that's a koi pond that um, somehow it's just been abandoned so the land is kind of like sloping down but that's a good thing for you at least you won't have any water retaining in the back of your properties and um, Let's see if I can see it right here. You're looking at the back of the house. It looks like they just power wash it. Moving back inside. So coming from the breakfast area, you're entering into the um, great room or call it as a living room. Um, here's your fireplace. I think that's a gas. It looks like a gas fireplace, and you're looking at to the backyard from here. Kind of like the interior paint is colored pink. I mean, the paint is can still be restored a little bit, minute um, painting, some touch up here in this areas. Well, that is the foyer area. Now, it looks like it's pre-wired alarm system right here. That would be your coat closet right in the hallway. Moving on straight through will be your hallway with all the bedrooms. So all the bedrooms are on one side. There is one to your left. This is the condition of the carpet. Still in good shape overall. They look like they just vacuum it. And this is the interior paint on the wall. The blinds are still in place. 
so now um, I don't have a flashlight but this is the bathroom the bathroom has its own sitting area and it's tiled let me see it is tiled it has a door sliding door there's a mirror about the, above the commode Cabinets still don't look good. And then on your left, across the bathroom, would be the um, the laundry room, which is a pretty good sized laundry room. And if you do have a double um, a front loader, it would be a perfect size for it. And then that's where you control for your electric panel. Now, if we head back out to your right, will be your master bedroom. This is a huge bedroom. It's kind of like a two bedroom that's sort of like split. But um, this is the area of the master and there's another area here where you can actually put your bedroom. So there's a closet right here, which I guess this is a his and her closet, but this is one closet into the master. You walk in straight through would be the um, part of the master. And this is your ceiling fan. To your right would be a huge walk-in closet that you could actually walk through it to it here. So, and then here's the master. This is the view in your window is actually your, your master bedroom would be in the back of the house where you could actually see the um, backyard and it's very, very private. See the whole thing. And straight through would be the master bath, which has a double um, dual vanity. And then right straight through would be a garden tub, which is great with um, the commode here. I don't want to show that commode. But this is a walk-in shower. So you do have a separate shower and you have a garden tub itself here. And it still have the um, blinds too moving away from the master so the whole master would be look like these this is your master bedroom with one where you can put your bed that's one walk-in closet and then that's a walkway out this is another closet and another windows so now we're looking on the third bedroom coming up from the master to your right would be the third bedroom you can look at the um, carpet still in great shape and that would be the interior paint it's still good restorable paint I mean a little bit of imperfection but it's not really as bad now um, this is the room above the garage here's the whole carpet area it's not a bad size it's a really good size it's the largest room in the in the house besides the um, master bedroom so you can look at this way and um, pretty much good shape they did vacuum it and the, the um, looks like the previous owner did take care of the house and um, I don't see no you know stain on the ceiling area so it's pretty much in great shape so if you that's the stairways right here and you can just look around how the frog is so and moving back down and I think that concludes our tour to the property garage area it has a sprinkler system the water heater is here, the trash bin is already here.